everyone, welcome back to the channel. Please don't judge the silly outfit. I was wearing a coat, but gathering all the stone and taking it back here was a lot of work, so I was really hot and I took it off. Anyways, as you can probably tell by the title, we're gonna be trying to make an oven today. My plan for this is to make a box of stone on top of the heated floors, and the flame under this end of the heated floors will create a lot of heat on that bottom stone slab, and that's where the heat for the oven will come from. Without further ado, let's get right into the video. My first step is going to be to clear out these previous fire pits just because it rained recently and some of the mud fell down into the pits. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do is plan out what I'm thinking and then we can cover that in mud once we have it looking good. Starting to hear rain, but I'm hoping it's not gonna start downpouring. What a bummer, it actually is starting to rain. Darn it. <laughs> okay, so I think I got it all planned out. I think it looks really good actually, and I'm starting to envision it what it'll look like with the mud on top. There are a few big holes that I'm worried about, kind of like this one, and there's one on the back, but I think I can find some small rocks to fit in there. Anyways, let's not waste any more time and let's start covering this with mud. See what I gotta deal with, people.
Okay, so I'm gonna interrupt the middle of this video for one second. I just wanna let you guys know about HatchetSurvival.com. That's where you can pick up your merch, the backpack, and other really cool attachments that go along with the backpack, such as this water bottle clip, which can be used for hatchets and other tools. At HatchetSurvival.com, you can pick up sweet merch, like, like our Hatchet Survival t-shirts. You can also pick up the backpack I use every single time I come out, along with different attachments for the backpack, such as this water bottle clip that can hold your water bottle and many other tools. There are plenty of other products on the website, so I really encourage you to click on the top link in the description. Okay, so I think I got the outside for the most part done, and now we're gonna start filling in the inside. Okay, cool, and I think I just finished sealing off the inside also. Okay, well this has been the video. Next week I'll work on the front of the oven so I can finish this up. I usually never ask for likes, but I've realized really the only way for your videos to get traction are if they do have a lot of likes. So if you all could please leave a like, I'd really appreciate it. The same thing goes with comments, so please leave a comment and let me know what you think of the oven. Anyways, I hope you all enjoyed this video, and have a great day. Bye.